Try to plan ahead for when you're gonna wake up, get ready, and leave out to be somewhere on time. Yeah, that was me. I kind of woke up late for me to get ready, be at the house, and be there on time. So I just pushed my wax appointment back to 145. So I'm on my way there now to get it. Get my girl and my underarms done. I don't have much, so hopefully, she can get whatever I got. I low key just tried to, you know, reschedule it for another day, but the other day, so I am leaving today. We're going back on the road to that club that I went to. Was that last weekend? Two weeks in, two weekends ago? Yeah, so I'm going back to that club. I'm going to get back on the road today. But this night, I'm going to stay out there for today and tomorrow. I'm going to get a hotel room for the night, for today, and check out tomorrow. Well, I might check out Sunday. I don't know. Y'all, I ain't seen me with no, like, completely no lashes in so long. I look crazy i look crazy and i just do a head on because like i said I'm, i was basically rushing to get some of my wife so, so yeah i will see y'all at my wife's point my girl she did not let me record so it is what it is i'll see y'all there Matt is in my wax appointment y'all Y'all, they got a Sephora right here, and the girls have been talking about uh, Rihanna. What is it called? Rihanna. The little body cream stuff, and it's um, limited, edition, limited edition. I want to try it. I want to try it. I ain't trying to follow the trends, because I ain't really like a trend follower. But I want to try it, so I might go to Sephora right afterwards. I'm looking for the Fancy. Okay, so this Fancy makeup, fancy skin. I think I see it, y'all. Fancy skin. Oh, I think they out. I think they out. New butter drop shimmering. It's nothing right here. Uh, they are out. And my camera is on. So I'm talking to you when I get home. I just got home, y'all. Well, I've been home for a little second. I just came and I hurry up and put my batteries on the charger. This battery is kind of like charged up. So I'm letting the other one charge up. And I had packed me a little bag. I'm not going to be gone long. So it didn't take me a minute to pack. Just some like dead night clothes, you know, some pajamas. And my toiletries and my makeup. Didn't take long. Then I got my dance bag. Oh, uh, let me show y'all what I got from Sephora. So I had picked up me some Brazilian bubble cream. If you know, you know. I haven't had a Brazilian bubble cream in a little minute, but I love this stuff. Somebody told me that I put them on. I don't know if it was just one person or if it was a couple of people. Like, thank you for putting me on a bubble, uh, the Brazilian bubble cream. Somebody said, I'm like, you know. Smell really good. And I'm I got the bigger size. You know, they got like little travel size. But this is the big one. Other than that, we are about to leave out. I got everything packed up. So we about to leave out. About to go to the gas station, fill the tank up, and just hit the road. Another thing. We're being a dancer and traveling and going to these different cities, different states or whatever. One thing for sure with booking a hotel, me personally, I don't like booking hotels too far from the club, but I also don't like being too close to the club, if you get what I'm saying. I don't like being too close to the club just because 
customers and weird people, you know? And I don't want to go too far away because I just don't want to be driving 50 minutes at 4, 5 in the morning to the club and to the hotel. But I wouldn't want to go far. I would probably do like 20 minutes, 20, 25 minutes away from the club. Or maybe probably like 15 minutes. But I'm not doing no five minutes, seven minutes from the club. Like what? No, I don't trust that. I don't like being too close. But yeah, just that was just a little tip for y'all. When you you a travel dancer, don't get too close to the club and don't don't go too far away. Meet it right in the middle. Okay, so yeah. Yeah, we got thirty seven minutes before we get there. Y'all, so we here in the room. I'm just doing like my little check, you know, because I don't, I don't play that type of stuff. Like any little thing, little dirty I see or anything, got to go. It be mainly like the bed. The bed be my main concern or problem with being dirty. I don't play that. Okay, the shower. Shower not that bad. It's not bad at all. Y'all look just worn out. I look so worn out. This is the bathroom. I'm doing a look quick look, so I really don't care about it. Me, I'm not even gonna lie. I'm, and then this is the bedroom. Let me finish doing my inspection. I don't play that. Put this, these sheets up. Let me put y'all somewhere. I like this little coffee station. Like her little coffee station with a mirror. Then you got the desk and this little coffee station, okay. I said like we would never know if a bed is really dirty until like you put it under a blue light one year I forgot when it was probably like a couple of years back one year it ain't got nothing to do with me it was just, it was either on the news I think it was on the news but I seen it on social media because I don't watch the news on the news they went to different hotels seeing how hotel how dirty hotel beds is I hope this don't gross y'all out because I'm not trying to gross y'all out for real so but that's why I just say do a check anyway for the things you can see, like hairs and stains. Just do a check anyway. So I don't want to gross y'all out. They went to different hotels seeing how dirty hotel beds is. So they looked at it, you know, with they two eyes just like I did. They didn't see nothing on the beds. But they had, they marked it. They marked the bed with something or something. And then they put it under a blue light. And hella like dirt and shit came up. Like they be doing it because housekeepers don't be changing the sheets and shit. But it is what it is. It's just a you know cool little. I have a refrigerator right here. Cool little hotel just for the night. Um, yeah, it's cool right now. The downstairs is beautiful. The lobby is cute. It, it's cute. They got like a little bar where you can eat and drink at. 
like a whole little restaurant is cute so i might end up going down there to go eat and drink if not today i'm gonna go tomorrow i'm about to chill for a minute and then i'm gonna show back here and show when i get up i have put on instagram q a for the vlog mini q a for the vlog so i seen some questions already so when i start like doing my makeup and stuff once i get out of the tub the shower i will do the q a with y'all all of this love is Hey y'all, so it's Saturday. Um, I just checked out of the hotel. I'm trying to find me something to do. I'm not really hungry because I had some Waffle House literally at 5 this morning. So, yeah, so I had Waffle House literally at 5 this morning. So I'm still kind of like, I don't know if I'm still kind of full, but I'm not hungry at all. Yeah, I'm not hungry at all. So, I don't know. I'll probably end up going to get me some food, but I see they got a roof crisp, but roof crisp don't open to 4 o'clock. That's everywhere so you probably give me some roof chris but it's not nowhere near four o'clock it's one it's 143 so so that's what it is um this my bag from last night i'm about to strain this up and count because like i don't have nothing else to do at the moment the club was slow yesterday but i feel like people was you know fucking with me so i don't know i probably i probably make much money because I seen how slow it was, so I'm thinking in my head, I'm in my head like, okay, my goal is at least $500. Because it was so slow, like nobody really was in the, people kept coming in and out, in and out. Then, what the fuck is that? A Bobby V? Ew. I'm glad I got hands in the charger. But until about like three, like the club was closing at four. So like three something people was coming in, but it wasn't a lot of people coming in. And then it's like when they was coming in, they were just sitting around talking, having a family reunion. Like this is not a family reunion. This is a strip club. Y'all coming to spend some money or what? And then y'all come and last some mini just to talk. Like, come on, be fucking for real. All this ten dollar bill. Big bill right there. I did like, how many dances I do? I did two dances. I did two dances each with two different people. But with that club, the price is like, is your price. So it's like, I really didn't know what to charge. That's my fault. So I was really just charging $25 each for song. Yeah, they don't have like private rooms where it's like VIPs and like certain you know different clubs different clubs have okay hold on my little week but if y'all watch different people channels like different stripper blocks or whatever certain clubs don't have like vip rooms where it's oh six hundred dollars for an hour or three hundred dollars for a half an hour or something like that every club is different you got clubs that got back rooms and it's thirty dollars a song or twenty dollars a song so clubs every club is different every club is different then you got this club the back room is your your price you know what i'm saying so and i try to like negotiate like not negotiate i try to tell the person that i'm gonna dance with before we go back there you know it's my price so and i i tell them the price like yeah it's this woo 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 to make sure they still want to go because i'm not gonna get back there and then we do the dances and then you don't give me my money because you're like oh that's too much or i ain't have it oh no poo we're not doing that so i be trying to tell the people before we go back to the price so again yeah. so i'm about to finish counting this because i don't have nothing else to do but i'm about to find me something to do i'm about to hit this girl up on instagram that i met two weeks ago when i came out here she was cool. We follow each other on Instagram. We've been having a little conversation. I'm about to hear her up and see, like, what's the vibe? Maybe she'll want to go get a drink or something. I don't know. But I'm about to see. So I'll check back in with y'all once I uh, finish counting this to tell y'all exactly how much I made. To see if I made my goal or not. It's not giving that, but it's not giving that, but I'm trying to see. Okay, y'all. So done straighten up the money. Do I look orange? I don't know. But I uh turned my car around so the sun won't be too much on me. But 
they're trying the money how much do y'all think this is take a good look take a good look at them mm -mm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm just playing. Take a good look how much I think this is. And then I have some big deals. I have that. And then I have. So this automatically 40, 50, 55, 60. I had another 20, but I spent it because I had bought Waffle House. Yeah, like I said. So. That's that, and then this. Take another good look. Tell me how much y'all think this is. I think it's a good, like, two something. Like, two. Two or three all together. We about to see. That's it. Yeah, why do I look so orange? Y'all look orange, so y'all do it. I look good. But, yeah, let's see if I made... I know I already made the gas money back. From filling up my car before I left. So I already made the gas money back. I spent $56 on gas. And this is $60. So I already made gas money back. So that's a, that's a plus right there. Made my gas money back. Let's see if I made the hotel money back. So all together it was $185. It was $185. But you know taxes and um, what's it called? Damage fee or something like incidental fee. So it came up to $255. So let's see if I made the hotel money back. Y'all, I don't know why my makeup is looking so orange. Or am I just tripping? I don't know. Maybe I'm tripping. So, so this is 400. This is one, two, three. And then it's some 20s and some ones up here. Um, I couldn't put it in a rubber band because it's too small. So, this is 100 itself. So, this one, this two, this three, this four. And then this is... $18. So all together I made four eighteen. Woo! Y'all. Yeah. I almost made my goal. I could have made my goal. I I could have probably made my goal. Cause how dry it was, I'm like, oh my god, just let me make at least five hundred dollars. Cause it was so dry, y'all. But the people that was there, they was fucking with me. And I was happy with that. I'm like, oh, okay, they fucking with me. Okay, they like me. They like you, girl. Okay. Um, so let's let's do some calculations, y'all, because I want to see if I even made um my money back for even coming out here. So, like I said, hotel was 255. 255. Was it 255 or 244? Hold on. Let me check my bank account. Okay, yeah, two fifty five. So two fifty five for the hotel plus I spent fifty six dollars to fill my car up. So that's three eleven already. So I'm at three eleven. Okay, I made that three eleven plus eighty five dollars because the house fee was eighty five dollars plus eighty five dollars. Let's see what that equal out to. Equal three. <laughs> Three ninety six. So I made over there. I made four eighteen. So I'm gonna do three ninety six minus four eighteen. What was my little profit? Nothing too major. Twenty two dollars. Twenty two dollars was my profit. But at least I made my hotel money back and my house fee and my gas money back. At least I I made that back because when I tell y'all it was so dropping up. That's why I only got like one clip because it's just. Well, I got me showing a club. Y'all seen the club? It was dry. It was already like 11 something. Y'all seen it wasn't really nobody up in there. And then I showed the little first love money that I made. I made out some these two guys. Well, I made out one guy. The other guy, he wanted somebody else, but that was cool. So I was on his friend. And I made that love money, my first love money off him. So he he started blessing you, girl, first. He ain't blessed me so much, but he was blessing me with a little fives and some ones. So. Where is these people walking to? I gotta, I be, I be so alert. I watch my, I don't play that. I be watching my surroundings. I don't even like sitting in cars, to be honest, but I feel like I'm in a decent spot. So, yeah. Um, I hope it be lit tonight. I'm trying to make at least 1500 At least 1000 
and some change or something around now. I'm trying to make at least that. But I'll see how the club is to see if I'm even going to make that much. It depends on how the bag's going and stuff. So, Oh, if y'all wondering, like, why I didn't um, stay another night, because I didn't want to stay another night. I just want to, you know, go home after the club. That's, that's what I really just wanted to do. And also, the hotel that I was staying at, so it was, you, I was telling y'all it was 265, right? Okay, I'm like, okay, cool. So how much is it until Sunday? But I already knew that I wasn't going to say it until Sunday. I'm like, okay, how much is this until Sunday? She told me 800 and something dollars. And you know, after the after tax, it's going to come up to NASA. So I'm like, why is it so high from 255 all the way to 800 and something dollars? She's like, because it is a game going on. It's a football game going on today, college football. So everybody is out here. So I'm like, oh, okay. So I might came on a decent weekend because y'all know it's the first of the month. So y'all know when it's the first of the month, nobody, nobody really be want to come out in the clubs for real because it's the first of the month. It's the beginning of the month. Everybody just pay their bills. They don't be really want to come out. But when she said it's a football game, it's college football. So everybody is out there, out here. So she like. Yeah, everybody gets out here um, this weekend. Well, everybody is going to be out here tomorrow, but it's a whole bunch of people out here. This hotel is literally packed up. The parking lot is packed up. So I'm like, oh, okay. So I'm out here. I'm thinking like, okay, I might do be going out here this weekend. College football, everybody going to be out here. Okay, cool. So I, I feel like it's going to be lit tonight. I hope it's going to be lit. I can feel it. It's going to be lit. It's going to be some money in there. Everybody coming out. Hopefully they come out to the clubs. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, get them sections. Book them sections. Let's get it. Let's get to it. But, yeah, so I'm going to buy me some food. I'm still not really hungry. I just really want to sit at a bar and drink. Not drink much because it's, it's only one something for me to But it's 5 o'clock or something. Well. Who gonna judge me? People be waking up at 7, 8 in the morning drinking. No, nah, I'm just playing. But I ain't gonna drink much. I just wanna have a little, a little appetizer. Probably like some hot wings and some fries. Ooh, I want some truffle fries. I'm about to see who, who got truffle fries. Yeah, when I went to L.A., I never had truffle fries before. But when I went to L.A., they put their mark on me, babes. I was at my hotel. I went down to the little bar or whatever in the hotel. They... This one recent. This was all the way in like March, April. If y'all was wondering, this is what this one recent. This was all the way like in March, April. Cause y'all probably like, why you ain't vlog? This was like all the way in March, April. So yeah, I'm gonna try working with y'all later. Cause I feel like I'm just rambling. I just need somebody to talk to. <laughs> I'm gonna call my mama. I'm gonna call my mama somebody. Cause I need somebody to talk to. <laughs> How cute is this tree? Is that a tree? No, nah, it's not a tree. It's just like a bit like a tree with likes on it. And you go around in circle. I guess to look at it, I'm not sure, but I just pulled over so I can see it. I'm about to take a picture on my phone. I feel like a straight tourist. Oh well. This how that's how people be in Chicago. I kinda wanna get out. I think I'm about to get out and take a picture. Everybody else is getting out. But I don't wanna be like everybody else. I am not a follower of the leader is. Yeah, yeah, so I'm Police on bikes. I don't know how long I can be right here because I got my hazards on. And this is not even a park. I want to get out real quick and take a picture of this thing. And then I'll be back. Yeah, so I got out the car. I got out the car to show you this tree. I don't know if it's a tree, but it's like it. I'm going to take a picture on my phone. This is, but I'm about to take a picture on my phone. And they in my 
I be in my way? Hold on, yeah, I'm about to take this picture on my phone. I ain't got nobody's picture. What's up? Give me a camera. Boom, I got the picture. Let me get back in my car. I got the picture. Y'all, let me get. I said, let me get back in my car because I got the hazards on and I do not know if I could be parked right here, but I just pulled up. I, so this is located downtown. I feel like a straight tourist, but this located downtown. I'm like, oh, look at that. This not even a tree. What is this? I don't even know what it's called. I just seen all the lights and stuff. So I'm like, I'm about to get out and see what that is. Up close and personal. I get too close. Not too close. I know every big as hell. But I guess you go around in circle and you can see it. They got like snowflakes on the building. Very festive. Very festive. Y'all, I just wanted to show y'all this, but yeah. I'm about to listen to my music. Everybody getting out taking pictures and videos. Oh, you can take a picture in front of it? Oh, you can. Oh, shit. I'm still in reverse. You can get on this thing and take a picture in front of it. Oh, they got the big camera. Oh, wow. Brown went down an hour right? and this man was looking at me like he was like to see where I'm at and when I was coming out the hour he acted like he was looking back at whatever he was looking at right so I'm thinking like oh yeah he gonna get to follow me around this damn store and I ain't gonna lie a lot of creators content creators probably like one or two that I've been watching been saying that people in Target been following them and I look, I'm like, yeah, he on that weird shit. Gee, <laughs> I seen some lady come out the aisle. They end up walking together. Like you with your whole wife. Oh, let me see this. You with your whole wife looking at somebody else. Mm -mm, I don't like that. These look, these lamps is cute. Look at this lamp, y'all. She's cute. This one, it's like a little oval. And like a little circle at the bottom. She's cute. It's like gold. But it's not that bright of a gold. Like a brass. Brass gold. But yeah, like. Ew. That was just so nasty. Mm -mm, I ain't like that. I like this one too. I like this lamp too. To go like in my living room. But I don't like the brown at the bottom. No, I don't like that brown. But yeah, I just went around this whole Target looking for plugins. They don't have a whole aisle with air freshening and plugins. And I did not even know that. And I'm looking for lamps. To go like when I get my um my nightstands, two lamps to go on my nightstand. I've been looking online. Ooh, these are cute, y'all. Look at this lamp. These are cute. Oh my god. These are cute, and guess what? It's two of them. Two of them. Um, I need. I don't really like like the bottom. Yeah, like marble looking at the bottom. I don't like that. Wow, these are cute. I need them. I don't even have my nightstand yet to figure out. You know, but I know the accent is gonna be gold. My bed is new, but these are white, so it'll be fine. I need these. Oh my lord. Can I do a layaway? I need them. These are so cute. 
I'm proud of this hiker picture. Y'all, yeah, these are too cute. What y'all think? Let me know in the comments. These are cute. Let me take a picture. I need oh. my big old butt. Shawty got a big old butt. I'm gonna knock the hole. Better knock the hole. What's this guy's shelf now? Okay. I need those. And why don't you grab them? I'm really thinking about grabbing them. I'm really, um, I really don't like the bottom of them, but it'll come together. Y'all, should I grab these right now? Oh. But like I said, I'm not trying to rush into getting things. I'm trying to take my time and make sure I get what I like, you know? These are... These are decent, but I want, like, square. Square shade. Whatever they call. These in the back is cute. These are cute. I like this. But if they was bigger, look how small they is. They small compared to these. Look how small they is in the back. I like that cream in the bottom. Yeah, see if they had those bigger, but with the square, like how that is. I get them, but I will see them. Let me take a picture of those. Let me take a picture so I can. Okay. Okay. But other than that, well, yeah, like, like I was saying, I didn't see no plugins. Target don't have no owl with a whole bunch of plugins. And I'm looking for some, um, yeah, look what I found. I asked the worker, he talking about some, it's some right here. It wasn't right here, it was like on the side. But most of them was gone. Like, you ain't know. But it's okay. I'm not even tripping. Not even tripping. About to give me some Febreze plugins because my boo said, try the Febreze plugins. You will love it. Okay. Trying to see the back. All right. I'm going to grab these plugins. Then I'm out. Y'all, I thought I seen a Home Depot in this same parking lot. Maybe I'm tripping. Um, yeah, I want to try to go to Home Depot. Maybe it's across the street or something. I want to try to go to Home Depot and see if they got these bar stools that I've seen online that I want for the crib. It was two of them that I want and I've I seen both of them online. Oh yeah, it's literally seven minutes. Oh, okay, this way. Oh, okay, they go the same right there. So, the same right there. Why well, I thought I was in the same parking lot. It is not in the same parking lot. Okay. But yeah, I want to go to Home Depot real quick and see if they got these bar stools that I wanted. Like I said, I've seen it online. But that don't mean they don't have it in the store. It is in the same... I just missed my whole turn. It is in the same parking lot. Let's see if I can go in right here. It is in the same parking lot. Just the parking lot over. Please don't tell me I got to do too much to get back to right there. It don't look like it. What shocked me though, it's like, I never knew Home Depot sell like bar stools. I thought Home Depot was like house improvement things, construction things. Not, I know they like show you bathroom stuff. Not bar stools, but we about to see. We about to see, and it's like a men's store, so I really don't even want to go up in here. But I think, ooh, this rope up. I really don't even want to go up in here. Like this is a men's store. I'm not here to even buy nothing. I just want to see if they get it out, and if they got the bar stools, do they have it on display so I can see it like in person? You know what I'm saying? Before I ordered online. But if they do got in store, I'm not even going to order online. I'm going to get it out of the store. Just not today. Bar stools. Let's see. I don't want to go around the whole store. 
and ain't playing music. Excuse me. Excuse me. Do y'all feel bar stools? What you mean? Bar stools? We don't. Oh, okay. No, man. I was going to say, I seen you online. I online. Didn't, I didn't think y'all sold them yeah, in the store. Uh, online. Okay. All right. Thank you. I knew it. I knew it. Oh, but it was a shelving that I seen online. Hold on. Ooh. Ooh. Look at this gold faucet. Ooh. Y'all. I'm looking for this bookshelf for my my um beauty room. If y'all ever seen them shelves, they like white. Then they have the gold like hardware. I seen that online too. I'm so mad that it get dark so early. Like it's only 4:38. And it's dark already. But I'm about to put this stuff away and get the cleaning of the crib because look at that. I got a dishes to wash. And I gotta put this stuff up in my bathroom and like clean my bathroom. I really don't have much to clean. It's really like the kitchen and the bathroom. That's really the main things that I need to clean. And like I said, I'm filming a TikTok, so TikTok and sweet it. My child. But let me show y'all what I got from um Target. So y'all think I got me some more in the store. I just love these things. They, just, they actually good. I don't know why people say they be banana skin. I'm not even used to it, but that's what I thought I was going to I got me some beef cup noodles. Y'all eat noodles too. I don't know about y'all, but I'm going to see it. I need some noodles. Yeah. I got me some Fabrice plug things. Got one from my kitchen. Got some berries. I got the scent. I got that um, boil water. water. Smell good. I got this Dawn Platinum um, Extra Squeeze. Y'all, I've been seeing this. Where did I see this at? Have I seen it on TV and they were squeezing it? Yeah, I think I've seen it on commercial. I've seen this on TV. I'm like, I'm going to try that. I got two of these. Got me some Febreze so I can clean out my. my um, my mirror in the uh, bathroom, y'all know. You be brushing your teeth and stuff. Stuff be splashing on the mirror. So, yeah. I noticed I ain't had no Febreze. I mean, not my Febreze. I noticed I ain't had no Windex. So I'm gonna have to make sure I grab some. Yeah, I need some flushable wipes because after you do what you do, that number two, if you're not extra wiping, whether it's with flushable wipes or a wet, um, tissue or getting in the shower right after you do it. Um, what you doing, sis? <laughs> I'm just playing. I got me some life for the toilet, toilet bowl cleaner. Got me some more sponges because I, um, I like cleaning the sponges. Got me some more list of I use this now because my teeth is still like sensitive. So I use that, but even though I use that, this really don't have a, like a, it got a clean and fresh um, taste, but I still afterwards, after I use my sensitive toothpaste, I still go in with a different toothpaste. They actually have like minty um, taste. Got me some Mrs. Myers Clean Day multi-surface everyday cleaner it said you can use it on any type of countertop or whatever so i'm about to try this out see what it's given got me some eos 24 hour moisturizer body lotion i want to see what this be like because i am a dry you know dry um dry skin type of person and i want to see what this be like because i have to put on lotion so many times so i got the vanilla the vanilla cashmere this smells really good and the coconut waters got these two you know, it's really good. And maybe one day they'll sponsor me because I'm just gonna know they sponsor the girl. I'm about to try my y'all better y'all better sponsor me. Got me some more since now toothpaste. One of them is deep rip 
repair. Repair for taking another one is sensitivity and gum. I just noticed that. I thought I picked up two sensitivity and gum because of my teeth. Um, and then I got me like a little lighter. Take a little cup out of the I'm all like my candles. And I got me some paper towels, but I'm not picking that up. So yeah, about to start doing what it do. And I'll come back to you. I probably am. It's fat. It's full. Four forty-three. I probably end up going out somehow. Gotta see what my girl on. See what the vibes is. I act for you for like what's the vibes. So we gonna see what the vibes is tonight. Might end up going out. Might not. Not. Just don't end it. If I do end up going out, I'm gonna bring y'all with me, whether it's my camera or just my phone. So yeah. I'm alone. It's so crazy missing you when I get old. Now Julio made me fool for you. Now I might hit your phone up with that ba ba ba. This is my da da da. This is my da da All of this love is toxic. All of this love is toxic. All these bitches ain't cousin. No shit. You a damn drug, yeah. Toxic. Okay, y'all, so good morning. It is Monday. It's the next day. Did I check back on the channel today? I forgot why I left off yesterday, but um so yeah i had a last minute booking oh i look so crazy and i don't have no lashes i look so pale but i had a last minute booking yesterday this is the money that i made over the weekend y'all already know what that is that's the money i made over the weekend and then i had a last minute booking this is exactly why I don't do parties. I stopped doing parties like a year or two ago because the last party I did, it was just a fail. Last night was kind of a fail. It wasn't all that bad, but it was kind of a fail. So let me tell y'all, let me give y'all a rundown. The reason why I didn't take y'all with me because I don't even do parties. I only did it because a friend asked and I took her word when she said they got money. It's going to be money. I took her word. This is exactly why I don't do parties. One. The deposit we got was only $100. First off, deposits is $200 and up. $200, some dancers charge. So I'm thinking we're getting like $200. They handed us $100 up front. But wait, the one, the first thing it was that they didn't send a deposit. They talking about money up front. I wasn't even supposed to go out my house until that deposit was sent to the cash shop, Zill, Apple Pay, whoever. I wasn't supposed to leave out this house. Okay, then the next thing was, we only got $100 for the deposit. Third thing, it was supposed to have been five dancers. It was only two of us. It was two of us with only four guys there. That's not a party. It was a get together. <laughs> so me and a girl dance, none of the other dancers showed up. But look, they told one of the girls that they had 3000 I think they said 3000 Me and the girl only split it $600. And plus I deposit. Y'all do the math. Add it up. This is exactly why I don't do parties. For reasons like this. Waste of time. Bookings don't be all that good. Some be good. Some don't even be all that good. Yesterday was a fail. I mean, still made, you know, a little bit of money. I came out the house. Because I was in the house not making no money. So I came out the house and made something. But still wasn't all that. So as y'all seen, I was facing my all my um, dollar bills one way uh, to make it easier for the bank. And the bank had gave me these $100 uh, strips. So I um, took my rubber bands off and put those on. It's the reason why she gave them to me. <laughs> so I was trying to make it easier for them. Um, I was sitting here watching my girl Aaliyah face. I said, Mom about my girl like i know her she know me but we know each other <laughs> now nah, we know but sitting here watching her and i'm also uploading we're trying to upload today's vlog 
Got 16 minutes left. Oh, I can't leave out yet. I'm trying to go to the bank and deposit this money, but I'm trying to go to the bank and deposit this money, but I can't leave out yet until that vlog uploads. So just sitting here. And then I feel like it's taking all day because I don't have any internet yet. So I'm using like Xfinity hotspot that you could buy online for like an hour or a whole day or whatever. So that's what I'm using. So it's like, it's been going in and out. So I have to keep reconnecting. But I don't have no internet yet because I don't have a TV and I need to get me some internet. I don't think I showed y'all my pot set, y'all. I got this pot set, this cute pot set from Walmart. Um, I got it on Black Friday, it was on sale. So cute, it's like this new pot set with gold handles. Let me show y'all. Look at this pot set. How cute is that? So cute. Those are old um, little pans, pots, whatever, pans, whatever, that I had when I first came because I was just cooking like breakfast. I just love them so much with the gold handles. Like, oh my gosh, it's too cute. And it's not, not a stick or something, however you say it. So, yeah. And I'm lighting the candle. Got my champagne toes going. Mm-hmm. Yeah. She smell like real good. My house just smells good, period. My house just smells good, period. And I changed all my plugins to my uh, to the Febreze plugins. Febreze, right? Yeah, I changed all the plugins to Febreze plugins. Y'all. I finished that TikTok. I finished editing that TikTok. I was editing it before I got the last minute booking. Then they called. I had to stop doing what I was doing, get up, get ready, rushed to go do the booking. Because they claim they was waiting on us all day. Y'all was waiting on us all day. Y'all don't even have enough money. But it's cool. Um, yeah, did the booking. Then I came back home and started editing it again. I feel like it looks so cute. So. Y'all, if y'all want to follow me on TikTok, follow me on TikTok at Diamond Ice. Same as my YouTube name, one, the number one. So it's Diamond Ice, two E's with the number one at the end. I didn't even want that, but somebody already got my name. Who got my name? Oh, uh, y'all can see my bed. I opened it because I wanted to see the hair. I don't want to show y'all yet until... Well, y'all can kind of see the color, I don't know. But I don't want to open it up yet until, I mean, show y'all the bed until it's like put together. I don't know, do y'all want to see it? Should I show y'all now? Nah, I'm going to wait until it's out the box. But I hope y'all enjoyed this vlog. I'm ending it off looking at mess, but it is what it is. I hope y'all enjoyed this vlog. Um, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and come back for more videos, y'all. And also, turn on post notifications to get notified every time I post a new video. And I just want to say I love and appreciate y'all so much. I'll be reading the comments, and I'll be cracking up, y'all. It's crazy. Some of y'all be a little negative, but, um, okay. We ain't worried about that. But I love y'all so much. I love all my positive people, all my positive girls, my positive men, all the negative Nancys. I'm going to pray for you, boo. Have a nice day. So, like I said, I hope y'all enjoy. Don't forget to come back and watch more. And I will see y'all my next one, boo. Because I'm working. I'm working, I'm working, I'm working. Bye, y'all. Then dip me underway. You can kill my mother's love and I will fall. Hold me till I scream for every year.